But I made the rule for it. If this doesn't work, okay, I will explain later. For now, let's make interaction. Z46, who is now losing? 2 to 1 to 1 to 2? That's a little weird. Z46 is playing US on the bottom left and on the top right we have Warring who just now winning 2 to 1. That's much better than sounding at the Okay, both players are trying to secure their oils. Yeah, they are going for it, except this engineer he's just throwing somewhere else. I think Z46 brain is already melting under the pressure. Okay, there is some safety pillboxes and GIs are securing other entrance into base. Warning doesn't need to that, he can just spam a conscript, no need for silly sentry guns. There is the Tesla reactor and more factory in production. And there is open still placed. Okay now and more factory in production as well. There are Tokos standing right next to the oil of the Z46 and he still have both these but looks like Warring is going for both of the oils of Z46 he wants them both and Dogos are going into the town they want the scouting information and they will get it this is full scout on Z46, there are still two logos, there are chrono mines in production and there are conscripts just saying hey come get me bro you cannot because your infantry sucks man. Jaguar tanks on the production, there is full scout from Z46 as well, he can see this. And Fluctor is trying to destroy these trees to place our refinery on the low ground. Only one miner for Warring, so okay, but all oils are for warring right now. He has four oils, which can basically reproduce one close miner on the oils. Okay, there goes the checker. He tries to crash something, but there are GGIs in the field, and these conscripts will eventually die to pillboxes. But it doesn't look that great right now for our Z46 player. I must say that conscripts are raining in and they are trying to snipe racks. Not the most valuable target, but they will probably succeed it. Okay, there's more pillboxes and conscripts are running around the base trying to do something, but they are just <laughs> destroyed by this imagined line of the pillboxes. Okay, and <laughs> Z46 even managed to capture his oil during that chaos and he's going for his <laughs> second oil. God damn. <laughs> And there is no army for warring, he probably thought, okay, this will be end. And no, it's not. And he just said, fuck, I don't need any GGIs, I just need a lot of pillboxes. And there is tier 2 on the field for our US player. And there will be seal IFEs, which can rain down on these easily. This engineer will never succeed. If the Rocketeer had something to say about it, but nah, just going elsewhere, man. I think he misclicked because engineer is right there. Okay, that's a shame. Okay, another engineer was sniped by CIFE. And this one, if, if careful, Mike, you can kill all of these. Yeah, Warren doesn't want to fight. No, he wants to fight. No, I'm running back. Okay, half tracks are on the field but they cannot deal with CLFE it's more like CLFE can deal with half tracks and repair drone is here nothing in War Factory ok right, right now it's Jaguars air bases more IFVs and there is tier 3 for Z46 he wants tiny IFE ok there is a capture on the oil it's back to even oils and if you ask me Warring should be destroying that oil because he cannot secure it. Same goes with this one. There are more Jaguar tanks in the production, more conscripts, no more conscripts. Okay. And Foxtrots. Now, Foxtrots can actually deal with the Tanya FE, but they can also fail horribly. So it's more like luck based if they can kill it or not. Tech center should be done any second right now. Okay, or it's in the jeopardy. 
they will be destroyed. Almost conscripts paid for it for their lives. This repeller almost paid for it for his lives. Another airbase. There's no tier 2 for warring player. He's just going full tier 1 with Foxtrot support. God damn. I'm not sure he wants to meme or if he just want to crush him with his early stuff. But right now Z42 have full tech. But almost mined out base. He needs some space. He's moving his M C V on the low ground. He wants to secure this. But there is no morale or anything. Okay, there are Foxtrots going for Tanya F.E. And Tanya F.E. is dead. And Tanya is alive. No, not anymore. Uh, MCV is still not deployed. He should be deploying that. And there is the... Mercury strike, not Mercury strike. The stuff on the Jaguar tanks. And MCV is in the jeopardy, but he, I think he will manage to secure it and not fail. Okay. For some reason, conscripts and Flactropus stayed behind. They would be great use for warring, but nah, I don't need those. Armor forces are enough. Okay, Tanya is back and Tanya is sniped. Then. Okay, the trots are just here for Tanya. And conscripts are going into the town, they won't destroy tier 3 and they will probably succeed. Warhawks are running down on these armored forces and uh, so far it looks like they will succeed but almost all miners are destroyed. Those riot troopers are just toying with those conscripts and this chrono miner will probably survive. This is chaos, Warhawks are raining down armored forces of warring. He managed to move his MCV to the ore field. There are some half tracks which can destroy the Warhawks, but they will probably not succeed. Okay, there are four Warhawks. GG from Z46, he doesn't want to compete and Warring won the series.